two vivid takes on the four seasons. One by Vivaldi, the other by Piazzolla, are the focus of this CSO program, led by violinist and conductor Julian Rocklin. Antonio Vivaldi was an ordained priest who spent much of his adult life teaching at a Venice school for abandoned and orphaned girls. He never could have imagined the future success of the Four Seasons. His set of four violin concertos, today represented in more than 200 recordings, plus countless TV ads, soundtracks, and remixes. Still, pictorial music was becoming all the rage during the Baroque era, and listeners of the day relished Vivaldi's brilliant depictions of spring cuckoos, summer storms, drunken peasants, and a crackling winter's fire. First published in 1725, each of the concertos is accompanied by a descriptive sonnet, possibly written by Vivaldi himself. The composer matched his music to these texts, even printing each line of the sonnets over the musical passage it explains. Astor Piazzolla wrote the Four Seasons of Buenos Aires in the 1960s to portray the changing seasons in his native Argentina. Originally scored for a chamber ensemble with bandoneon, the accordion-like tango instrument, the suite had only a superficial resemblance to Vivaldi's seasons. Leonid Desiatnikov arranged it for solo violin, strings, and harpsichord. He also worked in some clever references to Vivaldi's version. In Piazzolla's summer, for instance, a bit of Vivaldi's winter concerto is heard, nodding to the fact that the seasons are reversed in the southern hemisphere. The program also features the Divertimento in D major by a 16-year-old Mozart. It's believed he wrote the Divertimento after his second trip to Italy, and it echoes the brilliant string concertos that he would have encountered during those visits.